Namaste, love and light, water signs. Hope all is well with you guys. It's really all my love and my abundance and prosperity. Happy Lionscape Portal Day. Happy Lionscape Portal. Um, yeah, so I feel like water signs, y'all always dealing with people like sizing you up, looking at you funny because your energy is just so raw and so authentic. Like, I feel like you go with the flow. That's what I'm getting. You go with the flow and you could have had like a community of karmics after you like that is like the main thing like honestly it's not it's it's almost like they want to be the main theme in your story like these people they want to be in your energy and doing all these things that's the vibe i'm getting all right but it's like i'm getting these karmics they want something from you and they can't have it some type of special medallion or this is almost like um a reward your karmic rewards they can have that you guys achieve something huge spiritually you defeated a damn demon all right and what i was getting strongly from this is like like they want to be the theme all right, the main theme. They want to be the main theme. They want to be the main role, the main star in your movie. This is a doppelganger y'all was doing look because you guys are destined for a lot of money to come in. You're destined to make a lot of money. All right, with this world, all right, this is almost like energy that's at a distance from you, but it's coming towards you very soon. This door to value, water signs. All right, this could be you networking really well, all right, and you guys um, stumble across the opportunity that's, that's where you're able to make a lot of money or this is like you manifesting your heart desire and a part of that is you no longer stressing over your finances having financial freedom and you have somebody behind you cloaking themselves as an angel and they're really a demon trying to, to take you from you take you take this gift this door of value from you Ugh, i'm getting my word twisted because there's a lot of things they try to steal your gifts your blessings your soul yes and they got nothing this is someone that paid the devil and they even have enough payment for the devil so this person now owes the devil all right they could and I'm, I'm like double trouble as well i'm hearing that double trouble again this is someone they owe the devil a lot i shared that all right uh when i said the karmic is contemplating it's a short i shared a short water sign y'all should watch that and it says the title is the karmic is contemplating on how this spell work is not working and also mention how they have to pay a high restitution that is their karmic debt right there balance this whole entire karmic community karmic community community of karmics they're all receiving karma now because what they did to you they should have appreciated you all right now that you're gone and 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 they want to appreciate you when it's too late that's what i'm getting whatever this karmic community is they're gonna wish they appreciated you or they would have wished that they would have you know i'm seeing them trying to grab you like these people wish they would have like grab onto you or like like and like grab you and, and pull you back in and this time treat you differently all right this is this is like some weird energy because y'all didn't expect this type of energy to come from like it could be a group of females a collective group of karmics it was all in that same weird attached energy where they want to pull you back in and try to you know restart things but you're just not feeling that i feel like you guys are here you are the healer of this age and you guys are here to help heal this age of aquarius yeah you have a soul contract on this planet you have a mission on this planet to heal all right, and these karmics plan, they was part of the plan to destroy you. Because they don't want you, or they are part of the 1% plus that don't want, you know, the world to ascend. They don't want you to ascend because they are part of that plan. You guys definitely have a soul contract with the with the um, universe. All right, which is also connected with the soul contract with this planet. Okay, because universe and, 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 and earth is connected. All right, and this is also a part of God's plan. Okay, as well, it's all connected. It's all co it's all um being coherent. So it's all together. It's all connected together. All right, and I feel like you guys could be putting those pieces together, and the comments are trying to send you a lot of attachments, trying to send a lot of energetic attachments, so you won't be a healer of this age. Okay, you won't be the healer of this universe. All right, you guys could have been crowned. Like I'm not even gonna lie to you, water signs. All right, I feel like you guys definitely um achieve something huge spiritually it's almost like 
Oh my God, I don't, I don't, I don't know how to de- how to describe this. I don't want to make it seem like I don't want to put y'all on like you know a ego trip or anything like that. But it's almost like you guys were like deemed on number one, and like whatever you accomplished, it's like you're being deemed number one, number one, in the cosmos. Like you're being praised in the, in the cosmos. I don't see that that'll make y'all ego trip, but you know you got some people here that watch tarot just to feed off of information like this and they're not even doing any work to receive that but they hear it and they're like oh this psychic said this and, and then no they're not even speaking how it was a collective reading for a whole different sign but some of them they do that so i just want to make that clear all right y'all yeah, come from the pyramid border signs i'm getting that you guys are a whole comedic being these comments are saying they from egypt too but i don't see them there they, they're not there around the time you was there anyway they could have came way after the fact Way after Egypt fell, way after the Earth trans, um, will transition to the new age, or the old age, which is age of Pisces. This whole two thousand plus years, we was under like a dark cycle, and we're coming out of that. We're shifting into a light cycle now. All right, and I feel like water signs. You guys are just revealing a lot, and somebody, I feel it. Somebody's trying to stop your spirit from revealing the truth. All right, the truth about this planet, the truth about, you know, that the right that the light workers need to know. That's what I'm feeling strongly. They were trying to block your path, your spiritual path. Strongly, they were jealous. They didn't want to see you do this. So they're like, I know how to do spells to block you from doing this because I don't want to see you doing this. Like, I, I don't I don't feel or see you as one of the chosen collective, even though you're doing the work to do so. Water signs, this is crazy. Yeah, uh-uh. And it was, this is like, they were so focused on your relationship. I feel like your relationship and their relationship have nothing to do. Well, your relationship have nothing to do with them, and your and 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 their relationship have nothing to do with you. They're trying to like add in a relationship, like make it seem like you attacking their relationship or you involving their relationship. This is like an, an escape goal. All right, that's the scapegoat for them to use, I guess, as an, the scapegoat is you attacking my person. That's their excuse to attack you. That's their way to escape from their craziness by saying you attacking their person. Then talked about this. And you guys are so magical. You guys manifest with love, with your heart space. These people want to keep figuring out how you do magic, how you do magic. You manifest from the heart. It's not that hard. But it's hard for them because they got a lot of attachments on their soul. Or half of them ain't got no damn soul. And they need to heal. And this is someone that like put their relationship in this drama you never added their drama in it's like this is someone that put themselves in this energy you never put them in it they put themselves in that and i feel like you guys been trying to heal from the shit that they did try to put you in that they try to put you in but didn't work but you gotta clean off that psychic debris you gotta you know heal from the projections the pain that they did cause from you even feeling what they were trying to do to you they don't realize the thought alone can traumatize a person damn like you really was thinking that way towards me you really was trying to do that to me that alone can traumatize somebody that thought all right the truth is not it's, it's not always easy sometimes the truth hurts the truth hurt at you these people don't realize they so focused on you knowing the truth they don't realize the fuck the truth hurt yeah you grateful to know but the truth still hurt you star seeds water signs so I feel like this is someone that, that needs to heal from the pain that they caused you. They thought they wasn't going to have to deal with that backlash. No, they definitely did. They have to heal from the pain they caused you because it was unnecessary. It's like your caring connection have nothing to do with them and theirs got nothing to do with you. This person just feel guided towards your energy because they are attracted towards your light. They want to almost like cover up your light and make it seem like it was them who did it, which is false. But they also want to come at you all abrasive and be like, how you did this? How you did that? Could be an earth sign. How you accumulated all this money? or Not even money. Uh, blessings. Goodness. Light. How did you get in this energy? They're desperate to know because this is someone, a sukuya, that done lost her divinity, that lost her light because she done sold it over to the devil. Let's just be real. She sold it over to her demons. She didn't give a fuck about it. Now she does because it's gone. Won't miss the water till the well run dry. Huh? And that's what's happening. That's the main theme for this karmic. The water is well dry. Now she miss it. Or now he miss it. I feel like it's a female. It's a, it's, they, she's trying to be like you. She's trying to say, I appreciate spirit like you do. I show gratitude and love to spirit like you. No, she don't. She's a liar. She's false. She can't even like 
say the same things that you were saying anymore because it's not sounding true. It's false. She know that she she was stealing from you. It's like there's so much to be revealed to you, star seeds. More signs about this karmic. I feel like it's like spirit don't even know where to start. I feel like a lot already been revealed to you, but it's just like there's so much more that this karmic is trying to block you from knowing that you already do know. All right. And or you don't know, but you about to find out. Okay, listen, page of cups, you intuitive. That's what they was all jealous of. And I feel like, listen, it's like the little bit of magic or intuition that they, like, listen, no, 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 let me hold on. The little bit of magic that you do have, all right, well, no, 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 let me, that's not the, that's not the right way. All right, I'm seeing like a speck of magic. That's just a part of all of the magic that you have within you. But that one speck of that magic alone tears their asses apart. All right? And if you aren't all that intuitive, if you just a page of cups, and that's a, listen, that's a good thing if you're getting it from a positive perspective. Because a page of cups could also be, um, I could have a block third eye, um, block intuition, okay, block in, in creativity. But it's only if you, like, you get a shadow aspect or if, you, if it pops up reverse for you, if, if you read reversals, right? But... This person is trying to say you just a page of cups. You you don't really know much spiritually. You just still learning spiritually. Well, that little bit of intuitive power you have is is enough to threaten this mofo to make them think that you attacking them and you're all in their energy. This person don't realize they gave themselves up just by talking and and, and saying certain things that they, they told on themselves. And I feel like this person gave their gifts away, trying to take yours. All right, literally, they gave it away. They could even sacrifice their own gifts to have your gifts, and they didn't. And, and, and it worked on them. How did it work on them, Star Seeds? By them not getting the gifts, and you don't need their. It don't work that way as well. This person don't realize that they don't work that way. The way this person may think spells work, it don't work that way. So they think that they can just take your gifts and make us do a soul sacrifice, and that's not going to work because you high rank, you high level, you're not on their level. And even if you was low level. I like them and, and, and on their level, it would have been a fight. They just can't run up in your energy and take your gifts. I'm watching dragons. Okay. But my whole thing is the sacrifice worked on up worked on them, okay. In the sense of their gifts got taken away by the same entity that they try to send towards you to send your take your gifts away. What didn't work is your gifts being taken away because your gifts can't be taken away. All right, I'm hearing just give it, so take it, or something like that. So basically, the gifts that was bestowed to this karmic by the spirits, including God, were taken away. All right, but I feel like this person thought they were going to be successful and prosperous off of stealing your gifts. They really believed that. And you see, they see that you are gifted, which is why they wanted to take from you, Star Seeds. Don't allow these people to make you think you ain't gifted, because if you wasn't, they won't be trying to steal from you. You are very successful and victorious. You're very um, victorious, and you have a lot of successful energy following you. All right, you're going to be prosperous. Your prosperity is, like, on the way. It's following you. Yeah, you worked hard for this. You didn't do any dark spell work to obtain your birthright. You unlocked your, a part of yourself, your higher self. You unfolded. Like a magical flower, all right? You're like a magical lotus. You tapped into your crown. You found who you are. You worked on yourself. That's all you did. You don't have to curse and bind and hex and do some type of dark sacrifice in order to find your destiny. You found, you listen, you worked on yourself. You healed yourself and, it, and you so happened to find your calling, your life purpose. Around the time you decided to heal yourself, the gods called you, including Father God himself called you in and said it's time my child okay so many things happened to you spiritually from the time you done awakening and was called to right now all right and these karmic been trying to stop you from reaching your calling or you already done reached it reaching your goal you're already halfway there they tried a lot and it, it did fail yeah i don't want to make this too long look they are in karmic energy nine of wands do not let them back in Y'all, listen, there's a few karmic sent to you to destroy your destiny. 
All right, they was trying to get to you before you even fulfilled your destiny, before you even reached that calling. All right, a lot of you guys are supposed to probably been be gone a long time ago, but guess what? No, nope, it didn't happen. That happened today, ass. And you're going to start hearing your karma dropping like flies with the five of cups. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, I have your karma's already regretful, resentful. I'm telling you, listen, some of them could have been ex lovers. In the end, they're going to be wishing that they was with you, that they can spend eternal love and life with you. All right, it, nope, they can't. They can't. They just simply can't. Okay, they just simply can't. Why is Angel of Balance here? You are okay. The more karma they send to you, the more you are okay. The more you become okay, water signs. They are a hot mess. Appreciation. Yeah, they try to use you as a puppet. This was a puppet master. And and they didn't appreciate you because they were trying to use you as a puppet and have control over you. Dictatorship and shit. Dominate you. And now they realize that was a bad idea because they caught up in those same bindings and spiritual co commitments and contracts that they try to put on you and, and tie you in and bind you in to keep you as a puppet. Literally. Literally. They are binded and cut up and, 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 and fucked up. I don't know why I'm getting cut up. They are buying it though. Maybe they're trying to cut up those bindings and it ain't working. Or maybe this person getting cut up. I don't know. But this person is buying caught up. That's yeah, there we go. Caught up. Okay. This person is caught up in all the bindings and biddings. They try to bid your soul, sell your soul. They caught up in all that energy. They caught up in all of that. All right. I'm to they thinking that they cutting those cords. They thinking that they are. They feel like, oh, I put it out there so I can easily cut it. No, it can't be undone, stupid. Why is Karen connection here? Justice, yeah. I feel like a divine couple is receiving divine justice. Karmic justice is being served for this divine couple because a lot of injustices was 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 caused against you two. And justice is being served. Yeah, it's like look a couple. You and this couple deserve to have a new beginning. Y'all deserve to be number one. Are in the cosmos right now because it's like you guys are like you could you guys are like on point it's like you guys could be like defeating it, it, it's almost like let me just look at it like let me just say it like this it's like you guys are defeating a lot of monsters right now in the cosmos right and it's like you're defeating the most monsters and it's like you got the highest score you're number one that's how the divine look at you right now like all right, no matter what you've gone through, you withstand a lot. Your resilience is like it got you to that number one. Your strength, your courage, it's like your strength, your endurance. All of that is what led you to this number one status here. There's other number ones, but we just focus on you right now. You and, and, and I feel like, listen, your person fought beside you, side by side. Y'all both deserve to be number one right now. All right, patrons, okay? Listen, patrons of success, what? Or patron of success. Some of y'all make sure make a patron is going to be successful. Right, let me look at what patron is again. I think it's like a guardian. So you guys are like guardians of, like, guardians of success? Like, hmm. Like, so maybe this is like successful guardians, okay? Or you guys could be guardians that guard other people's success. Like, you guys are protectors. You guys may protect other souls on this planet. Okay, you guys are a spirit guide. Patron, what? Maybe I ain't spelling P-A-T-R-O-N. Oh, well, showing up something else. A person chosen name or honored as a special guardian, protector, or supporter. There we go. So you guys are guides. All right, you guys are guides, and you guys like guide, like you guys guide slash support other souls on this planet. Like your higher self, okay? Whoever you are in the spirit, you guys know who you are in the spirit. Powerful God, powerful goddess. All right, yeah. Listen, libation. Wow. All right, I said that. People are praying for you, Starseed, Water Signs. And this, their prayers are working. Maybe people are going to donate to you, all right? Or with this religion, you may come from, like, Christianity, a Christian background, or religious background, but now you're more spiritual. People are praying for you, all right? That's what I'm getting. You were, like, once a god slash goddess that was praised, okay? Like, literally, like, you know, you have certain saints that's praised, and they'll pray on this saint. You guys were one of those gods slash goddesses. That's what I'm picking up. Yeah, look. 
that's a part of what makes you successful is the fact that you guys were a walking or well, still is a walking god and god god or goddess and you guys were praised it's almost like you had your own statue like how the the comedic beings were you know idolizing praise all right Yeah, this is like the achievement here. It's like you being a god or a goddess. It's not. It's 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 not only just like a gene, but it's almost like a, it's an achievement for you to get to that god or goddess status. You have to achieve. You have to work for it. It's not just something that can happen. A lot of people be having that effed up. They thinking they can just do what other gods could do, and like you know, you gotta. It's levels to it, and I feel like you guys took. You know, you went up those levels and took the proper steps, and you guys won. You guys, you know, completed. Y'all gonna well, listen. Y'all about y'all gonna complete this mission that you came on Earth, but there's other missions you completed for the divine, all right, for universe, other, you know, other spirits, all right, and 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 you successfully completed those quests, those missions, and and you guys were victorious. It gave you a lot of achievements, okay. Like trophies, okay. It's almost like you got a lot of trophies, and you're like you're like a praise. You was once a praise god slash goddess, water signs. I can't make this up at all. But um. It's your achievements, for the sign. You achieved. That's what's standing out. You're an achieved god slash goddess. Yeah. And you're always going to be wish fulfilled. You're always going to be highly favored because you are a praise god slash goddess. Yes. And your 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 favoring is strong. I, I don't know who this demon is that's going crazy thinking that you are one of them because you are a human. They may think y'all the same because y'all both in human form, but in spirit form, y'all, this person, they, they, they're not even on your level. All right, but um, yeah, water signs. I love y'all so much. Namaste.